Hi, I'm Katie Eastman with the Boston Herald. For one day only and not a minute more, as the president of Emerson College said, I can say that I graduated from the Ron Burgundy School of Communication. I'm, uh, I'm literally in a glass case of emotion right now. Tears of joy streamed down Ron Burgundy's face as Emerson College's School of Communication was named after him. Ron Burgundy's facts are more factual and his stories more compelling because he looks good. While the former San Diego news anchor only gets 24 hours with this prestigious honor, he plans to make the most of every minute. I didn't, first of all, I didn't realize it was just 24 hours, and um, <laughs> so I'm mean, gonna have to make some huge changes very quickly. The high school graduate of Our Lady Queen of Chewbacca was eager to give aspiring journalists advice. We wanted to know if you have any advice for how a male anchor and a female anchor can get together. and On a professional level. If there is a, a real juicy story, um, you simply have to, to have a fist fight to figure out who's going to report it. Some faculty and students are angry at the day-long naming, calling into question the integrity of the journalism school. But Burgundy had no comment on the criticism. That's below the belt. The second documentary about his life, Anchorman 2, will be screened at Emerson College Wednesday night, and actor Will Ferrell will introduce the movie. I love you. I really do. Some of the things that Ron Burgundy wants to change in his 24 hours here include adding a pool, making all grades pass fail, and putting in a jacuzzi full of baked beans. Reporting for the Boston Herald, I'm Katie Eastman.